Nice bit. It's still a bit of a kick, so yeah. I think a lot of it's going to be that kicking. So just trying to get out, and not even even if you bend in the legs, or just keep them slightly straight. You don't have to kick them heap straight. It's just going to get you used to not wobbling. Just come on in there. Yeah, cool. Oh, look at that. Much better, much more stable. Everything, heaps better. So you'll find slightly, you notice how you're slightly turning a little bit to the other direction? Well, you can see my shoulder. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, now we're starting to get on it. Just kind of keeping that steep good. And see, yeah, so you're dripping that, dropping there. A lot of it can be because you, you're just turning slightly, so just try to put that other shoulder down. Or you'll notice if you watch my body now, if I look at you, see how my body naturally wants to face you. So um, you kind of got to get used to looking and keeping the shoulder straight. And that straight. was it, so just off of your on that side. I'm yep. looking and dropping yep. the shoulder. So it's just getting used to turning the head, move the arms. But as you saw, you can see here when we go back, see it's starting to kind of cut with this hand a little. Yeah. So if you think about... Um, I, think, I think I was trying to turn, mate. Yeah, that's yeah, right. Yeah, so yeah. if you think about a kayak, so I'm gonna see if I can draw a kayak. We've got a fucking dude sitting here. There's his fucking head. And there's the paddles coming out like this, off the boat. So that's the boat there. If you stick this one in like that, he's gonna rotate around that paddle. Mm. Same as this one, if it's in there, it's gonna rotate around here. So think about your arms this part and this part, they're like paddles. Your shoulders are like a plane when it banks. So if you do your shoulders, you're gonna bank like that. If you do your hand, you're gonna rotate around your hand. So you can kind of dig that in as a paddle. But the thing is you might slow down a little bit as you do it. So you might need to do that and straighten the legs, vice versa. If you start bending your knees, so you might have one leg straight and another one bent like this and that's going to turn you and side slide you a bit as well. So you can turn with your knees, you can turn with your hands, you can turn with your shoulders, you can turn with everything. At the moment, <clears throat> don't worry about turning with the legs, we just keep them straight. Turn with the shoulders or the cup with the hands kind of thing. So that way if you start feeling yourself going that way, the hand turn is just like a, a smaller a sharp, turn. A smaller yeah. The big one, the shoulder one, is more like a big, big banking turn. Cool, gas, gas, gas. Nice, I'm getting used to having those arms back now. There we go again. I'm gonna maintain them. Yeah, sick. That's the feeling. So you'll see here how you slightly flattened out, and that would have been because you went and checked your healthy. Yeah. Cool. And see how slightly you watch the hands. So the hands are back, and watch them come forward now slightly yeah and that's what's kind of flattened out so just keeping that steep keeping those legs straight i guess i don't have to really check that like people got did it nah yeah you do but you don't yeah especially if there's both of us if we're looking at each other man that was a, that was the best jump we've done yet you can, you're consistent going fast you won't have a break anymore legs are straight you weren't bucking or whopping that's right yeah so you can see here how I'm like, you can see my hand. See how I'm like, okay, I'll let it go and they're behind me. And then I'm kind of cupping there a little. So I'm cupping this one mostly to try and get over towards you. Yeah. And see when I check my LT. So we'll see it's ready. Yeah, I'm just kind of rolling over and looking like that. So that way I don't really destroy my position so much. I just kind of keep it there. And then now legs straight together. Also, let's watch that again from the top. It's all right, good, stable. Now legs straight. Back, heading's good. You can see now you start to get used to start getting over more. Yeah. You can see that horizon. Ooh, yeah. Yeah. So is this where you're going too much to just try to feel a little? You surf or skateboard? No. A snowboard? Yeah. Yep. So you know when you drop when you first sit on the mountain, then you drop in. Same as this. You go on and dropping into it. And once you're on, you're on. As soon as you flatten out, it stops. And then on again. Oh, there you go. Drop down the mountain. 
spec. Now we can start working on um, little bits of turns, faster, slower, and now rather than me flying to you, you're going to start flying to me. Yep. So just getting more awareness, where you're looking, being able to fucking check what else is going on, see me, and are you drifting away, are you coming close, if you're going away, then you start coming close. Like as soon as I tell you to come close, you do it. So I was just now doing it without having to have a signal and yeah. just being able to be aware, come closer, all right, cool, I'm comfy here, turn away, oh, I'm going away, back here again. You, you're a base, not just go towards Yeah, down. I will come a little bit, yeah. but I'm also gonna not as much. Yeah. Yeah. Sick, same exit, same everything, that's all working, we'll just keep